value engineering is not cost cutting. It's, you know, it's performance optimization is what it is. There's a line with value engineering, right? There's, yeah. you probably noticed it when you framed is people seem to not care about everything that's actually holding their home together. They don't even feel like it's a home until you get sheetrock on the walls. And then they're like, oh, look at this. Now it's starting to come together. Not realizing that everything that month, six weeks, eight weeks, whatever it was for the foundation and the framing is everything that's holding all of those finishes. <laughs> right? I mean, I don't know how many times we've had this conversation and maybe right. this might even be an entire podcast worth of conversation on this one, but right. I'll just, I'm going to say what Royal said in a couple of different words that the dirt work, the earth prep, the foundation, the framing, those are the things that you cannot cut corners on. Those are right. the structural elements of the house that if you cut corners on or you do improper value engineering per his trust example is that you will have problems down the road. And that's what we mitigate as a structural engineering firm is we put our best foot forward into giving people the best possible outcome by knowing and being experts in that field to be able to say, no, you can't cut corners structurally. Do not cut corners on your earthwork prep. 